The Air T15 has four riding modes, pedestrian, which goes at 3.7 miles per hour, energy saving at 6.2 miles per hour, standard mode at 9.3 miles per hour, and sport at 12.4. At the back end of the scooter, you have a multifunction fender. It acts as a power switch and foot brake. A double press will switch your riding modes. Single press will turn on and off the headlamp, and then a long press can turn it on and off or use it to brake when you're riding. On the handlebar, you have a accelerator on the right-hand side, press down to go. The left-hand side is your brake. And then if you press both at the same time, it'll act as a horn. And again, you're able to use the fender as a brake. On the left side of the scooter, you have your kickstand, which also hides the power input to charge the scooter. If I haven't said it already, the Air T15 is beautifully designed from the handlebars all the way down to its wheels. On the front, you have a customizable light bar with many colors and scenarios. You can choose monochromatic, full color, or emergency lights. To start your ride on the Air T15, all you gotta do is bring up the kickstand, give it a push, and you're ready to go. The feature highlights are 180 degree foldability, retractable handlebar, four riding modes, bezel-less dashboard, IPX4 weather resistance, built-in front and rear LED lights, cruise control, power switch slash fender brake, and Bluetooth connectivity. Now, I am 5'10", and I wanted to bring over my friend Jay. He is 6'4". I wanted to show him the scooter, see how comfortable of a ride it is. I do know that the handlebar height is a little bit lower than some other competitive scooters, but as you can see here, he is actually riding this, and he's super comfortable. I asked him before and after the ride if he's ever ridden some scooters. He's had some experience. Then I asked him how he felt with this scooter here. He says nothing was pulling, he was not leaning forward, and everything just seemed comfortable and natural. Now taking a look versus competing scooters out there, you can see just the futuristic design, how much time was put into this, just how beautiful the wheels, the fenders, the lights, and just all around the way it looks, and especially that bezel-less dashboard. Just as flawless as the scooter itself, the unboxing was nice. You're able to open everything up. Everything was sitting in its own compartment. You also have the internals that is being able to be used as its own kick scooter stand. Once you pull out the kick scooter, you're able to pull off the protective film. You're able to set it down with the kick stand. Now inside of the foam on the end is actually the user manual, the plug, and also fender replacements. So here is the area for improvement and that is the turning radius when it's parked. Now when you ride the scooter you're perfectly fine but when it comes down to turning this around in your garage if you're trying to turn it around on a sidewalk you can see the limited space here which means for a large radius to actually do a complete turn. So it actually takes the full parking spot to turn the scooter around. Some other competitive products out there is able to turn much quicker on a dime but that's my only area for improvement. But I hope you guys have liked this video, and if you guys want to support this kick scooter, click on the link inside the description below. You have 30 days to save 24%. But if you guys like this video, make sure you guys hit on that like button. Also, don't forget to hit Moro is the world's most efficient, fully autonomous lawnmower. Moro was designed to save you time and give you a beautiful mowers. They take too long and are too much work. They're clunky, and honestly, you deserve better. Traditional mowers eat up your whole Saturday afternoon mowing. With Moro, it's a fat zero hours. Old mowers give off a lot of exhaust fumes and harmful greenhouse gases. Moro uses a rechargeable 28 volt Samsung lithium battery that gives off zero greenhouse gases. These outdated mowers are loud, basically an alarm clock for the whole neighborhood. While Moro being low noise, you might not even notice it diligently grooming your lawn. Spend your time enjoying your lawn, not mowing it. Moro is equipped with a protective guard and a bump sensor. Never worry about the safety of you and your family with the safe design of Moro. Moro allows you to make a customizable mowing schedule that adapts to your lawn needs. Mow every two days. Adjust the level of cut, whatever you want. Moro has you covered. Don't worry about the shape or size of your lawn. Moro uses a perimeter wire that sets the boundaries for Moro, ensuring accuracy in what gets mowed. With an auto return feature, Moro docks when the battery is low, when it rains, and when it's done mowing, making Moro worry-free and hassle-free.
Moro requires zero effort, zero stress, and provides the perfect lawn. Never waste a Saturday again in the sweltering heat pulling a lawnmower. Let Moro do it for you. Back our campaign today and enjoy the benefits of your hard work while not worrying about preserving it. Do you hear that? That's the sound of your door automatically unlocking as you return home. Introducing the Bozma Aegis, a new smart home door lock, which locks and unlocks using your phone's Bluetooth or Wi-Fi, and automatically locks when the door is closed. In fact, this lock will alert you if your door is left open, doing so without the use of an external sensor. The Bozma Aegis is one simple and versatile piece of hardware. Your physical keys will still work fine. Snap-on fingerprint scanner, and you can even unlock your door with the press of a finger. Or it's easy to share access with your family members and grant temporary access to your friends or guests. And with the activity history, you'll always know who's coming and going. Complete with unbreakable AES-128 encryption, no one gets in your home if you don't want them to be there. Easy to install in a matter of minutes using only a screwdriver. The Bozma Aegis is made specifically for the standard US deadbolt. Ideal for renters who may not be able to alter their door's locks. Bozma, simply better.